Hey, what is up you guys? Krusty here. Today I'm bringing you some gameplay of how I easily beat the new update in Granny. And the new update, if you don't know, is this other tunnel as you see right here. That, um, uh, it goes off into this outside place. Now what you're seeing right now is a note that I found. And it basically said that, um, somebody came, they were hurt, they like... I don't really know, but um, then they said that she likes to hide things in fruit. Hmm, I wonder what that could mean. Melon? So as you see here, there's a melon. Um, what do you think is gonna be in there? Something. So uh, um, right here, uh, I had no idea what was happening. I was making way too much noise, and I didn't, uh, yeah, I think Granny comes. You yeah, see, I was making so much noise. I didn't really know what to do. And as you see right here, Granny comes. That's because I didn't really know what was happening in the game at that point. I just started, I was trying to explore the new thing. I did not know that that was a door right there, even though I should have. Right here, I'm just looking around at things, where you see how um, this actually works here. And I'm like, hey, I have a melon. Something's inside of the melon. Let's put the melon in that. So I pop the melon in there. And then what do you know? It works. And out came the playhouse key. I went to the playhouse, opened that up, and I saw that I needed two cogs to get into there. This is a funny part because Granny is right there because she heard me earlier, but I'm inside the playhouse and she has no idea where I am. Do you want to play hide and seek? <laughs> right here I was like, hey I have a winch, there's a well. So it was like, I can put the winch in the well and get something up. I was trying the wrong end of the well that I got here. I was actually kind of paranoid that um, Granny would come out when I wasn't looking in here and like hear this, but she didn't come, which was very helpful. And as you see, what I got out of the well was a hammer in a bucket. I took the hammer that I had just got and I knocked out the parts of the um, board in the um, uh, door, and then as you see here, went to the kitchen. I found a cog in the kitchen, in the microwave, which is really helpful. And I went right out back again, and I put the cog in the final spot. And I was like, hey, there's, well, not final spot, but there is another one. I was thinking of this another time, but. So I put that in there. And then, uh, so then I, I saw that there's another one. So then I came back and looked around the house again for the other one. I went into the attic and knocked out this plank. And I put the plank in where it goes. And I, I, w I went to the other room and I found a cog in the drawer. So then I came back and went to the chute in the bathroom to put in the cog there. And I found that there's another piece of the painting right there as well. I then went out to the playhouse and put the final cog in, which unlocked this little drawer here, and I got the weapon key from that. So then I went up to the attic, and I broke the motion detector with the hammer. I went up and I clipped off, clipped off the, a wire to go to the fan, 
I got the safekeeping up there. I knew that I had made some noise, so I tried to hide in a little box. But it was too late, and Granny was right there, and she killed me. <laughs> When I got back up, I went and got the crossbow and the tranquilizer dart. I think I stunned Granny, and then I went and got the final piece of the painting and put it in the painting to get an extra bonus day. It turns out that the bonus day was actually very helpful because I needed it at the end. Then here you see, I took the tranquilizer dart and I shut off the screwdriver. And then I took the screwdriver and opened up the little compartment thing. And I think I got, yeah, the padlock. That's usually in, um, there, so I might make a video showing about that. I just tranquilized Granny and I went to unlock the padlock, because that, but as you just saw there, I had to, um, stumble over Granny because she was in the way. That happens a lot. So I went up and up to the attic again and I got the, um, pliers. I was planning on cutting the final wire in the door, but I fell off because I stood up too early. It was at this moment I knew I had fudged up because I could not find the safe key and I did not remember where I had put it. I then proceeded to look all around the house, but I could not find it. I was super confused at where I had put it. I then decided to use the wire cutters to cut the last wire on the door. I then decided to look back at the footage and I saw that I had actually gone the key in the attic and I had gone across the plank in the attic and then is where I died. You see I was hiding in there and Granny came right over, and then I died there. Well, there we go. I died there. And so then I swapped back to my Granny, and I was like, I don't see it. And then I saw a glint behind it. I was like, oh, because I had been looking for a long time, and I could not find it. Now that I had the safe key, I went over to the safe and easily unlocked it, getting the master key. I then easily went over to the door, unlocked it, and I had won.